everyone, since I'm like a vlogger now, I'm gonna vlog my trip to Artscape. And uh, for those of you who don't know, Artscape is a Baltimore event about like art with food and bands and stuff. I'm kind of late, it's like two o'clock. Been going on all week, but I've been gone all week. And I overslept because my flight got super late last night, but uh, this is an art outfit. And I'm gonna make sure I bring my water bottle, my wallet, and my sunglasses. <laughs> All right, bye guys. This is my cat. Hey everyone, I finally made it up to Baltimore. Driving was the most stressful thing. And uh, like all the roads had cones and detours to make room for art escape or whatever. It was awful. And I finally found the like art escape parking. It's $15. And I looked at how hot it is outside. And it is actually um, uh, 100 degrees. I don't know what the feels like temperature, but the actual temperature. It's 100 degrees out, so uh, I'll have fun. And it's like 320, I think, right now. So, yeah, that's what's up. Bye. Hi, everyone. So, I've been here for like 20 minutes. It's hot. I got a little fan, though. Um, there's a lot of... I'm at the artist market right now. I'm trying to find this band that I want to see but I can't find it. But here's like a bunch of art stuff, it's really cool. So like, there's all this cool art stuff everywhere, I guess. Like there are these, I'll put a picture of me with these weird astronaut orange things and they're also hanging from all these traffic lights. And there's like that man over there, which I don't know, I think that's no, okay. pretty cool. I don't know if you can see it, but up there, there's like this astronaut thing, which I thought was neat. I don't know. Yeah. So, I don't know what this is. It's like a sculpture. It's kind of cool. So, over here, we have some like hands. I don't even know. It looks pretty cool. So just walking. It's still super hot. I was looking at a ton of booths. I didn't want to like film the booths so. though. Well, it looks like in here they have workshops. That seems cool. Here, I'll come in here and check this out. So Okay, everyone, so I just finished seeing one of my favorite brands, Leo and Cygnus. It's great, I have some sketches from it if you want to see that later. I don't know. Over here, there's like this octopus sculpture. That's pretty cool. It's this guy drumming on some streetwear. I love it. Anyways, just walking. I think I'm gonna head back to my car. I'm not sure though. Having a lot of fun though. There's a kombucha booth, so I'm gonna go get me some kombucha. See you later. Hey guys, so I just got some kombucha and there was. Oh, look at this. So there was the cutest little kid in front of me. It was like, elderberry is so good. So, even though know, I'm usually a grapefruit kombucha kind of guy, I got elderberry and it actually is really good. Oh, by the way, when I was in that garage earlier, I bought the cutest sketchbook. It was like handmade and adorable. And I love it, so. Maybe I'll show it to you guys if I remember. Maybe. So I'm heading back to my car so I can go thrifting with my mom in Hampton. Maybe get dinner later. Cause you know, I love food. All right, see you guys.
Hey everyone, so I just bought the cutest, I'll show their card later. I think I'll do like a little haul when I get home. I got these super cute earrings and a little air plant and it's really cute. So yeah, I'll show you guys when I get home with a little haul thing, I guess. Sounds good. Um, hi. Excuse me all the time. I'm in an elevator trying to get back to my car. I'm not exactly what sure what I'm not what words. I'm not exactly sure what floor my car is on, but I'm hoping it was floor. I'm not sure though. Which is kind of not good. The floor seems kind of empty. Glad I have my vlog fam with me though. Lights. Gotta love it. Good thing it's daytime. If it was night, I would lose it right now. All right. Yep, I see my car. Okay. My face is super red. Let's hope I'm not burnt. Mom will kill me. All right. Bye, guys. In my car, go to plug in my phone like normal, and look what happened to my phone charger. The whole thing broke off. So. Yeah, and it turns out the bakery I was going to is closed, but there's a pizza place near it, so hopefully that's still open. Okay, hey everyone, so I forgot yesterday to do my little haul on what I got. So I guess I'm gonna show you guys that now. Um, so first things first, I bought this cute little sketchbook. It's lay there, she could like make the covers, but I chose this pre-made one because I thought it was cool. And inside of it, uh, she ran out of cards. So I don't have a card, so I can't really tell you what her name was or whatever. But inside, I got some, that's uh, inside paper. But there's sugar cane paper, and then I asked her to put in, that was not a good angle, some extra sketchbook paper at the end, which was super nice. Oh, that's her name. It's a uh, Drama Mama Bookshop. So check that out, I guess. And then over here, oh, well, I'm going to show you guys. So when I was there, I saw one of my favorite bands, Leo and Cygnus, and I drew some quick sketches, which I think is my favorite from the day. And then I got some new stickers, which I guess I'll add onto the next sketchbook that I go through, which I go through sketchbooks pretty fast, so that'll be soon. Maybe the back of this one, too, because the front of this one's already decked out, so I won't be doing that. Buy some moleskins, too, to go through. I don't know. So, I got this new Leo and Cygnus sticker. It has the band name. Um, ah. I keep forgetting everything's reversed because my camera. This new Leo and Cygnus sticker, which is, like, black and white. And, ah. and then this one, which I think is the coolest one in the whole world, it's holographic and has their little line logo, which I thought was awesome. Uh, let me put those all back in my sketchbook pocket. In case you're curious, the other two Leo and Cygnus stickers I have are this one and this one right here. But I guess you'll see that in like my next sketchbook tour. I think I'm gonna start filming those because I have so many sketchbooks. Um, then I went to this little shop, which is called Stitch Prism. They have ceramics, plants, and jewelry. It's made, handmade in Philadelphia. Hi, Taylor Swift. Um, so, first there, I got, like, this little plant for my art room. It's an air plant, so once a week, you just take it out and dip it in water. And the jar was just so cute. I think it was, like, $30, which was expensive, but the jar's handmade and all. And it's pretty easy to take care of. You just dip in water once a week. And then I got these cute little earrings, which came in this bag. Um, I'm trying to open them. And they're like little, I guess they're ceramic pieces. And they're dangly. So that's what they would look like. They went well with my outfit yesterday. So I put them like on when I got home. This is their business card, in case you're wondering. Stitch Prism. Da, da, da. Not a brain deal. And 
This is like the care guide that they gave me for the plants, which was really awesome because now I know what to do. And they also had cactuses and stuff. So, you know, it was pretty neat, actually. I liked the little store. Um, today is Sunday. So I'm not going back up to Art Fest because it's super hot out again. <sighs> and tomorrow, some eBay stuff to pack up and chip off. And. Yesterday, like in the morning, I shipped out some Depop orders, so it was nice. But anyways, I guess that's the end of my vlog. Uh, here's my cat, if you're interested. You can't really see her, can you? I don't know. I wish the iPhone cameras had a reverse thing. That's a problem for another day. I'll see you guys.